Well, I had just graduated from the Art and Design College in Clare Street in Limerick and uh, my boyfriend at the time had done the MSc here as well in interactive media, so I had the kind of the full story from him. And I was always very interested as well as art uh, with technology and gadgets and stuff like that. So there's kind of only so much a degree will get you these days, so I just decided to, to better myself and go for an MA or an MSc as, as now is the case. And I found myself here. It's really geared towards people who are basically have a wide interest in creativity uh, in general. I mean, there's, there's no one particular person that would be suited or anything like that. I really liked that aspect, the fact that you can come from an artistic or a more academic background and yet you'll be welcome on a course like this and find some aspect of it that will be interesting to you. Um, personally, uh, with the art background, um, I was very much into like photography and videography and I wanted to come here and learn a little bit more about that. They teach you the basics and everything and it's up to yourself then to um, basically take up those skills and better yourself and learn a little bit more about that. And uh, it's, it's really kind of the, the contemporary art modules and uh, the interactive modules where you get to work with gadgets and use your artistic creativity and there's kind of like limitless boundaries and they really encourage that which, which you wouldn't get in most other colleges. I mean, you know, it's not always in. The, it's not always behind a computer or listening to a lecture. You're out there. You can be working with people in music. You can be working with people in art or TV or radio. Any aspect of, of that create, creative lifestyle. And it's it's really really welcoming in that respect. When they say full time masters, it really is a full time masters. I was working as a fitness instructor up until February, and once the thesis kicked in and the latter end of semester two, I really didn't find it feasible to continue working. So I had to give it up for the time being while I was working on the thesis up until September. But uh, you can manage a part time job, and there's no point in saying you can't, but you really would want to have your evenings or your weekends dedicated to writing and to researching. Otherwise, it would, it would be very, very difficult to keep it going. Um, so the choice is there. I, I do believe that people could work part time, but it is, it's very, very tough. That's the great thing about this particular course. It is in the epicenter of what is going on now and what is like basically between now and the next five to 10 years. Um, what we're taught a lot on, uh, with the, the course and in lectures is, I mean, w we reference a lot of what's going on in science and in technology right now. And everything in science basically, especially at the moment, especially regards to technology, is always working towards five to 10 years into the future. So um, with regards to jobs and career opportunities, it is so, so broad. This course really kind of steals you for any aspect of creativity. You can do photography, web design, graphics, uh, any aspect really. You could, you could potentially go up and work in Hollywood or you could, you could do a small scale affair and work in a, a media company uh, locally. Um, there's really is a broad, broad aspect there. Uh, personally, I've always had a very serious interest in photography, art and especially teaching. Um, I've done some evening classes and I've taught adult education before and in some secondary schools locally. Um, so ideally, even though I, I kind of skipped the the intermediate course of doing the teaching and came straight to do the MSc. There's always the, the option to do evening classes and I, that really is the aspect that I'd love to get back into. So, I mean, there's with everything that they're teaching on the course, you, you could potentially teach that and a little bit more. Uh, just basically creativity is your limit.